Cosmopolis, or Cosmos Polis, depending on how you want to pronounce it. It's a story about a rich billionaire in his limo stuck in traffic on his way to get a haircut. Think I'm joking? The majority of this film takes place inside a limo. Robert Patterson. The dude from Twilight. And the majority of the dialogue is super, super deep philosophical discussions. Why is he stuck in traffic? Because the president's in town. He's talking to people about you know, how often he's going with his business. He's talking with his wife. He's talking with his mistress. He's talking with his other mistress. He's talking about you know, like why he's hungry. You know, as he goes out to grab lunch, goes out and grabs dinner. And then there's always moments that just really, really deep philosophical things where it's like, are they even talking to each other? Or are they just like, you know, spout off random lines of really deep philosophical issues? It's like, wow. They're talking about how like, you know, it's like, wow, so, so money has lost its values in the eyes of people who do not believe it has perceived value to it. And you're like, wow, okay. Okay. Along the way, of course, his limo is attacked by, like, an Occupy movement. He has some inside there who's trying to dis you know, essentially describe to him, you know, here's what we think and here's why we don't like you because there are things you've done. It's like, okay. Very head, very, very, very heady movie. You know, no action sequences. Some of the special effects look weird. Like, you can obviously tell that they put, like, blue screens on the outside of, of the windows. In some cases, the blue screens are the windows. That that kind of pulls you out every now and then, but very well done for a, a pretty in-depth, very thought-provoking sort of movie. This is one of those ones where it cuts down the center. You, you went, you'd be like, yeah, I, enjoy, I, I understood it. I thought it was stupid and pretentious. Or you're like, I have no idea what it is. Or you're like, I thought I understood it. I thought it was great. Or you're like, I understood it. I thought it was good. Or you're like, I was confused, but I loved it. So that's it's Cosmopolis. It's about a two-hour-long journey of a billionaire. And Robert Patterson, when he's not in Twilight, great actor. Dude can act very, very well when given proper material. This is some proper material for him to act with. You know, great job on his part. Everyone puts out a really solid performance for being in this really sort of bizarre, almost of a junk sort of film, but done very well. 